Hey, I'm Carl with Apt, and this is the Yamaha WX010 Music Cast speaker, and it's one of Yamaha's smaller wireless speakers, and for its size, I think it works really well. So we're gonna talk a little bit today about the look, the sound, and the functionality of this little speaker here. So let's start off on the outside. Around the front and the sides, you're gonna find a cloth grill, and that's gonna match the color of the rest of the speaker. Now this one here, as you can probably tell, is white, but it also comes in a black finish, so you have a couple of options to choose from. On the back, you're gonna find a spot to attach a wall bracket, which can be purchased separately, and on the bottom, you're gonna see a little rubber piece that's kinda of shaped like a horseshoe, and that's gonna prevent the speaker from moving around if you have it sitting on a tabletop or a countertop, anything, any kind of flat surface. Now, towards the bottom on the back, they're gonna have a connection for power as well as an ethernet connection, so if you wanna hardwire the speaker into your network, you definitely have that option but there's also going to be Wi-Fi and Bluetooth built in, so you don't have to hardwire it if you don't want to. Now, moving to the top, you're gonna to see some simple controls here. You have a dual function power connect button that you can use to set this up. Um, you also have a volume up, a volume down, and you have your standard play and pause button. It's nice having the controls right on the top of the speaker so you don't have to take your phone or tablet out every time you want to adjust the volume, but I didn't find the buttons to be super responsive. It may have just been me, but I was kind of finding that I had to push the button, uh, the volume button several times to get the volume to go up or down, and play pause was pretty spotty for me as well, but that didn't really take away from how much I enjoyed the speaker. Now you're also gonna find a few LED lights here up on the up on the middle at the top, and that's going to indicate whether you're hooked up through Wi-Fi, through Bluetooth, and it's also going to let you know whether the power is on. So it's nothing mind-blowing, but it's handy to have those little indicators uh, just in case. Now, in case you were wondering, if you like this speaker, you can pick it up right on our website or in the store. So if you like what you've seen so far, you can click on this little link up here and place an order. Now, moving on, we'll talk about the sound quality because that's kind of why people buy speakers, right? So this speaker, I thought sounded really good for being as small as it is. You get a, a three and a half inch woofer built in, you get a one inch tweeter, and then you also have two passive radiators built in. So it's able to produce a pretty good range of sound. Right out of the box, I will admit it sounded a little flat. It actually sounded a lot flat right out of the box. But through the music cast application, I was able to adjust the equalizers and make it sound really good, at least to my ears. So if you're willing to put in a little extra effort, you're gonna be really happy with the sound quality. Now, not only that, but you can also improve the quality by adding a second one of these to your set, and that's going to create a stereo pair, which is really gonna make the music come alive because it's gonna create two distinct channels, and then and together they they sound really, really impressive. Now, like I mentioned, I was able to use the app to, to really fine tune the sound on this. The app is really where this thing shines. Yamaha, the, the, they have this music cast app, and it's really easy to use. It does a really good job consolidating all of your music into one area, and it's super easy to navigate. So if you take a look here, you can see there's a bunch of options that this app can be used to customize your experience, and I think Yamaha's done a great job making it very user-friendly, which is important because technology can be a little scary sometimes and anything manufacturers can do to help is always appreciated. So that's a brief rundown on the WX010 from Yamaha. What do you guys think? Is it something you'd want to add to your home? Have you had a chance to listen to it in person? We'd love to hear back from you in the comments section. Also, make sure to click on the link in the description below to find out even more about this speaker or to place an order. As always, we appreciate you checking out our videos and remember to like, comment, and subscribe to our YouTube channel to see what we've got next.